we came here in the morning if you look at the surrounding it was very dirty very very dirty but right now alhamdulillah we have covered at least a lot from the petroleum station there fortune up to uh, this place or see this school mina we are not being paid for to do this kind of work this is something we initiated as a voluntary individual as a youth of the gamia no, i uh, recently collected the, the bottles and the plastic uh, spoons are going to be used for design like decorations and stuff like that and then the the, the main recycling thing that we were doing was the tires we're going to use them to recycle them into trash cans to place them in uh, certain places in Gambia like if we have everyone uh, supporting this journey like i think it will be very easy you know so that's a major challenge you know having people to be on board that's one of the major uh, main factors so Okay, welcome back, uh, viewers. We are here again. Kilindi Gambia is back. Today we are in Farado to do our weekly cleaning exercise. Like I always said, cleaning environment doesn't need any document to sign or doesn't need any approval. You have to clean your surrounding as usual. You have to understand clean your environment is important. Even you don't go to school, you have to understand that cleanliness is important. Cleaning your surrounding is important. Hmm? So I'm urging all the youth, all the Gambians, to collaborate with us. You know, to help us. You know, at least uh, to in fact improve this initiation is very important. Yeah. So as you can see, we are on the highway, the main highway of Farado. We are here clean surrounding. We came here in the morning. If you look at the surrounding, it was very dirty. Very, very dirty. But right now, alhamdulillah, we have covered at least a lot from the petroleum station there, Fortune, up to uh, this place, or see this school, Minda. Yeah, though today the turnout was not that much good, but at least we have tried to at least cover, you know, a lot on the left side of the road. At least, yeah, our aim was to cover both the left and the right side of the road. But unfortunately, we couldn't do that because of the, you know, the turnout was, you know, a, a, a bit poor. So uh, please, I'm, uh, I'm urging all the peoples, all the uh, citizens of the country to at least try and join us, you know. Yeah, try and join us. It will be very, very important. We need your support. We need your support, you know, at least. If you are free on Sundays, please try and then, you know, join us, please. Huh? Yeah.
Okay, um, we have another member of Killing the Gambia here with us, uh, who is a very, very active member uh, yeah, of the uh, association. Musa, uh, today what do you have uh, to tell the viewers? Because as you can see, we are here, you know, we have the school, we have the hospital, we have the federal station, and then if you can see, the highway is so dead, and we have the school, we have the hospital, and we have the federal station, you know. We have, you know, a lot of places where, you know, you know, people can use to, you know, for their daily activities. And then, if you look at that very place, it's, you know, very, very dirty. Yeah. So, what do you have? Do you have for for us today? Um, okay, um, uh, uh, Mr. Ture, uh, what I have is uh, let's just try and make sure that um, we just have the, the, the uh, determination that uh, we can do this more and more. Um, this is something that. Um, is a very good in, is a good initiative that we uh, uh, we try to put in the practice and since we start the practice and it's been going very fine you understand and um, the thing is um, let us not be discouraged by the people and the society at large yeah? this is something that um, if you're doing you have people that will discourage you of doing it and that's not going to help you if you want to focus on people what people gonna say about you that, uh, there's no way you can pursue uh, this this kind of journey. I know it's going to be a tough journey for us, and inshallah, with the help of the association and the team we have, uh, we'll pursue more and try to do more for the community and for the community as well. And this is something uh, as we have the uh, exercise within the, from the petrol station towards the school, Mindao Senior. And, and I'm very, very happy today that we have a good training exercise and very, very, very determination, uh, determination and the hard work we're doing in the practice. Yeah, so I'm so happy about the training exercise today. Okay, um, I always have this in mind. In fact, the last video I asked somebody about this particular question. Yeah. Like, he said, like, sometimes people, you do hear from people like these people, probably they are paid to do this work. Do you, all, do you also hear the same thing from people? Yeah, there's something, um, it's one of the, the sort of the things that I have been emphasizing on since even our last videos. Um, we are not being paid for, to do this kind of work. This is something we initiated as a voluntary individual, as a youth of the Gambia. This is something, we, we don't need any money from anybody to, uh, to sustain ourselves or to, make, uh, to invest it on ourselves. We're doing this, and uh, the, in fact, the government account that we created within the platform is not for the association or neither the executives. This is something uh, we initiated that we will plan to buy trash can for the community, and then and, and, and even to the beach side that we have been using, like uh, what uh, uh, which we have been doing our clean exercise normally, and then. Uh, so when we raise that kind of money from the GoFund account, and we're going to give it back to the community, not to the uh, to the association or to the executive. So do something. There's nothing uh, that has to do with uh, those, those money. is not going to our pocket, and it's not going. We're not going to invest it in ourselves. It's going back to the community. Mm -hmm. So this misconcept, we should not listen to that. And that's what I have. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much for that. <laughs>
Yeah. What are some of the difficulties that you have been facing, especially now, as far as you know, this cleaning is concerned? Yeah, thank you so much uh, for having me. Yeah, right now the difficulties we are facing is very much because like we need people's participation in the ground. Like we need people to join us on the ground. If we don't have many people on board, like it will be very difficult to achieve the goals that we want, you know. Like if we have everyone uh, supporting this journey, like I think it will be very easy, you know. So that's a major challenge, you know, having people to be on board. That's one of the major uh, main factors. There are other factors also because like every association also, you need to be financially strong in order to achieve all the goals that you want, you know. So financial also, we are facing financial difficulties. So we have a GoFundMe account, so we are raising money so that we can like buy the things that we need because we need rakes, we need this trash bag, we need gloves, we need this. So these are all challenges that we are facing, you know. So if we have support in that, like it will be really easy, you know, it will make our work easy. You know? So if we have, if you see all these leaders on the place here, yeah, it's because there are no trash cans here. Yeah. From the starting to this point, there is no trash can here. Yeah. So that's why you see all these leaders here. Yeah. There is a hospital around here. This is a pharmacy. This is a shop and there is a petrol station. So all these places are major places. But they don't put a trash can here. So that means it doesn't sell well, you know. So these are all difficulties that we are facing, you know. So we want people to be on board. We want people to join us. We want people like to put in resources that they have, you know. So we need all that, you know, in order to make this So these are the major challenges that we are facing, right? Okay, um, you mentioned financial, you know, issue here, like financially to support the association. Yeah. And then I have been hearing people saying like, um, there are many associations that were doing this, but as far as they get what you need, they stop doing what, you know, this clinical exercises. What do you have to tell those people that have such mentality towards maybe killing the Gambia also as well? Yeah, like what I have to tell them is like, let them not be afraid to invest because like, if they have been following us, like we have been very consistent in what we have been doing, you know, because since we started, like we have not been receiving any penny, but like we have been uh, doing the work, you know, but we received some donations, but that did not stop us from doing what we are doing because we have some money in our go for me so if we are looking for money because we have raised 700 and something dollars in our go for me so if we are here for the money like we would have collected that money and we find a way but if you see we did not do that it's because we have pure intentions for this you know like the goal is to make the gambia among the cleanest countries in africa it's not the cleanest but among cleanest cleaner countries in africa or in the whole world at large you know so these are the things so I want to tell everyone, like, let them not have that mindset. It's true, like, some association started this, but they could not go for that. They, they know they, they know why they stop, or they know their problems. So, some, it might be what you said. Some, it might be, they, like, they were facing difficulties or challenges. That's why they could not go. But for us, like, it's a different thing, you know. Because we are still focused, we have the determination in making this, like, a success, you know. So the goal is to make the Gambia among cleaner countries, you know. So the goal is not like to uh, uh, raise money and collect the money and use it for our personal gains, you know. Yeah, so the main issue is that, like, we want to put the Gambia on the map, you know. We also want ga other countries to look uh, up to Gambia, you know. Now we want other countries, like, to draw inspiration as we draw inspiration for other countries, you know. So that's the main goal, you know. Like, other countries will look up and say, like, how did the Gambia become clean? Or, like, how can we look, grow inspiration in other ways? Like, how can we look into the Gambian issue? Like, how did they make their country clean? Or, the time they were making their country clean, what are the things they were doing? So, we want other countries also to look after us in terms of these things, in terms of cleanliness. You know? So, I think cleanliness is very important in every country, or in every developing country, or in every developed country. Yeah, so that's what I have to say in that part. Say in that part. Okay, um, that like um, clean the Gambia <laughs> is cleaning every Sunday, every Sunday rather. Yeah. You are doing in cleaning exercise every Sunday. Do you think that clean the Gambia?
can clean the whole country? No, clean the Gambia cannot clean the whole country. That's why I said like we need everyone on board because like if we have everyone on board, like it will be very easy for us because we cannot go around in the whole country cleaning the whole country. It will not be possible, you know. Like we'll be we will spend here like people used to say, don't be yes. We will be here without the country, without attending the board. That's why we need everyone on board. If we have, if you are also in your neighbor, if you are watching this video, if you are in your neighborhood or in other places, you can gather in one Sunday, gather your people and call each other, arrange each other and clean your environment like the way we are doing here. Like what we are doing here, if other people are also in doing it in another environment, in another environment, in another environment, solely we will attain cleanness, you know. But for, for us to clean the whole country, that will be very difficult. Let me say it's not possible, but it will be very difficult, you know. So what I have to tell the people is that, like, in order to achieve cleanness in the country, we all need to work together towards it, you know. So we need to have everyone on board in doing it, you know. So in that way, we can attain cleanness, you know, in the country, you know. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you. We have another member of Clean the Gambia, another very, very active member, you know, the president of Clean the Gambia, our marina. We are here on the ground at your village, Farato. And then we have been working here from uh, 8.30 up to almost approximately 11 o'clock. And then we have collected a lot of trash. If you see the bags are there, we have bags, uh, uh, these uh, bags alongside the highway. And then, uh, how are you going to uh, deposit or dispose these uh, trashes, you know, after the cleaning exercise? Uh, thank you, M. Ture. Um, actually, after the cleaning and everything, um, since we have these garbage bags where we put everything, so we are going to contact the, the area council to help us dispose the trash. Also, I have another recycled, recycling bin. I put, like plastic bags and some plastic spoons and stuff like that for uh, recycling for our workshop thing, inshallah, yeah. Okay, yes, you mentioned uh, recycling here, yeah. collecting some of the, you know, waste or the materials that you want to recycle. What kind of things that you want to use uh, these things that you have collected to, you know, recycle? Um, we want to make uh, actually, the ones that we, the ones that I uh, recently collected, the, the bottles and the plastic uh, spoons, are going to be used for design, like decorations and stuff like that. And then uh, the the main recycling thing that we were doing was the tires. We we're gonna use them to recycle them into trash cans to place them in uh, certain places in Gambia, inshallah. Wow, this is amazing. Okay, thank you all.
Assalamualaikum badin jibiralu bi falale farra sado kono jam ah ah clean exercise tan bilalla qatar bi sado le don qatar woldo senendikan bal bi falan nara farra sado kono jam bi be woldo do nara ko woldo lara senendi kabo fojun essentiel do ah bala jam kada fo skulo nyati lola ah hadim bali hadim ah falan dim farra sado kono jam ko min ngafo min nyami ah kabiri nara jam sumanda ya sodeti afenke be no ring bakel yemene sodeti be fo la mole because kabiri nara ngaje la chakri bodo be siare jen an no chakri wa du la fa na be bala jam ngaje ko chakri bodo le fon siara ni plastic wol chakri wol le fon siara so ite mena sodeti mum fo la jibir la ani la moir la mi li alam ko wala ka dama jem ma fo ya ante mum fo la mole ya wala an na tray ra na jong sang ignore_time_segment_in_scoring ya amin bala ta kalan damma ti be kaf nyo kam be ya ya ku geda be ba ke mo lai na ngol so rob yes a komi meda kilinen fanana kilinen meda now this is more than 20 weeks kilinen exercise be min ke kam so it how do you feel comme ning kilinen waro sida how do you feel ya ande nga feel happy i feel happy because nga jele me mo kay ngi bangu do kam ba ci kan na bangu do so i need to feel happy yeah so ngo wo da man da ma kam motivate ba kele pour ka ke mu ka jibe mu ka say ka ke mu ka mu ka mu ka feel eh ine ine hori pour ka ke like ko bodi like yo da ma no ka ke le ko min na banko la yeah nga ke pour na banko la kam na banko di atu na ni na ban na banko la kalo kam ka ke wala ko yeah okay thank you so much na kam motivate pa Okay. Okay, bara ga baake. A bediada banko ka ka banko sinendi aka hada madun jaato kenya. Gamia non kal nyaajele. Sai na la basara internet le. Soal se fana ma koy do courant do motol teburu. Ni a fenge fon le kira kodol ta ye motol jo ye baka sol tambe te fay. Nko ali ajele da wada mul ka tarje gambe diun ka tarje karam mul do do tanol to marcel kono ede la bal wo bol nyaame tel kol le sinendi. Saatel gambe diun mul ba tamadu la. Ibala bangko sinende kanali ma koi otol to mun bale baka asol tikala puruka samba kada afa imbali di fai bla a oke a baraka nene ndela kuma kaunti konta nda kula bake a yurchol ma mun fole besa a wachi loke ni musa kafu no ma naka fai ma ni be do kuke kai ro kono bangko sinea bila be sinea soro fono fon ni kede a. Today we are having our clean exercise at Farato from the petroleum station, station towards this other side, you know. So we are done now. So we have collected a lot of bags of trash. Let, let me count them because this is three bags of trash. There are other bags of trash around there. So the time we came, the time we came, like there was a lot of trash in this place, you know. Like you cannot even imagine the place, how the place looks like, you know. I, I will even put the video. Some so I took some shots the time we arrived. I will highlight them so that you can see how the place looks before we started cleaning you know the place was very horrible you know as you can see this is a highway this is a petroleum station and there is a hospital around here and this is a school so this place is mostly used by people you know so i'm advising the people that use this place like let them abstain from littering in this environment you know because this place is really dirty as you can see we stop around there so we when we come next live we will continue from where we stop you know 
So this place was really, really, really dirty, you know. It, you cannot imagine, you know. So there we have three bus. So those three, three, four, five, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So today, Sunday, we collected eleven bags of trash, you know, because we have three there. We have two, four, six, eight. We have eight here. Eight plus three is eleven, you know. So we collected eight, eleven bags of trash this Sunday, you know. So today Sunday was very challenging. It was not easy collecting all these and putting them here, you know. So I'm urging everyone, like, if you are uh, uh, visiting places, don't throw trust in places, you know. So what we would like from you is to like, subscribe, share the video. And we have a go for me if you can donate or you can send it to family and friends so that they can donate to our go for me so that we can buy trust cans and achieve the goals that we want, you know. Yeah, so... We just finished uh, doing the cleaning exercise, you know. So see you next Sunday. Next Sunday also we will back at this place to continue from where we stopped, you know. Yeah, so these are the bags of trash we collected, you know. Yeah.